Good quarantine morning, LA. It's breakfast time. This morning, we're gonna be eating the Venice from North Hollywood's own LA Breakfast Club. I'm gonna be rating the Venice on four different categories. Number one, obviously, is how does it taste? Number two, what kind of value is it? Number three, how complex is it or how beautifully simple is it? And number four, are the ingredients distributed evenly or is one bite delicious and the next just okay? So without further ado, it's time to take a bite. So I'm gonna grab this half right here. So it did come with a dipping sauce, which we're gonna get into in a second, but I want the first bite to just be totally fresh, like this is what it comes as without any sort of sauce on it. So I don't know if you can see in, in here, but there's a whole bunch of avocado right here. And then all the other ingredients are kind of in this corner. I would really, this kind of goes to our, our distribution of ingredients. Because if I bite here, I'm gonna get no avocado. So I would really love if that avocado had been across the top here and all the ingredients were kind of nestled underneath it. Let's take a bite. Okay. So I took as big a bite as I could, but you can see I got almost all avocado on that. And the avocado is delicious. I love avocado. Take another bite on this corner, see if that's uh, giving me giving me any more good vibes. Way better. The cheese is really, really good. The bacon flavor really comes through. Bacon flavor really, really comes through. The eggs are a nice texture change. You know, there's not too much tortilla in comparison to the other ingredients. So you really get a sense of like all the ingredients in that, in that, in that bite. So the next, so now we've sort of gotten past that avocado layer that I was talking about. So now I think we're gonna put some sauce on it. We're gonna see, I think that the next, the next bite with the sauce, with everything is gonna be pretty much perfect. So let's, let's take one more bite. Really get in there. Nice saucy bite, nice saucy bite there. So I'm gonna go in. And there it is. I mean, you get, a nice kick from this salsa. Um, this is like verde salsa here. You also get a really great distribution of bacon, eggs, avocado, and cheese, along with that perfectly crisp tortilla. I mean, it is it is everything that you want in a breakfast burrito. Taste-wise, I would say it's a solid eight out of 10. 10 is gonna be the highest, one is obviously the lowest. I think that there's room for improvement, but I really like the salsa. The salsa is really good. The salsa really elevates it. Without salsa, that might be more like a six or a seven. With that salsa, it goes all the way up to eight. Let's talk about just, you know, we've kind of touched on it, the, the distribution of ingredients here. I, I think that it needs work. You know, I think that like having a one half that's just all avocado, one half that's all bacon and cheese, it's like, it makes for half of the burrito to be really good, but when you get the mix of flavors later on in the burrito, it's way, way better. So I would give that a five out of 10. In terms of complexity or beautiful simplicity, this definitely airs more on, without the salsa, beautiful simplicity. And in that case, I would say it's like a, uh, it's like a solid six or seven. They've definitely done a good job of trying to layer in some flavors, but it's not perfect. This is sort of somewhere in the middle where they can't decide if they want to make a really complex food item or if they want to make a really, really simple breakfast burrito for you to enjoy. So last thing is value. So as I said, I did add a bunch of things onto this burrito, but with that being said, um, this burrito as I have it right now is $16. Uh, it's $15.95 on Postmates. So that doesn't include delivery fee, doesn't include tax or anything like that. So it's, it's $16 on Postmates as a subtotal. And I would say that as a value, this is probably like a six or a seven. But I do think that there are burritos that are just as good, if not even a little bit better, for probably a little bit less money. But 
It's a great spot, the salsa is excellent. Highly recommend trying it out for yourself if you're in the North Hollywood area and you're looking for something to eat. If you guys know of a place that I need to go and check out the great breakfast options, especially if they have a good breakfast burrito, please leave it in the comments down below. Make sure that you subscribe to this channel and hit that bell so you know every time that we upload videos. I'll see you next week here on Breakfast Time.